All right, guys, so today we are back to trying to complete the airstrike mission. It's our last one for White Lotus there. And we're also gonna be showcasing the Rowl. I love this gun. I've used it in BR quite a bit. It's pretty amazing. Um, and we're gonna show you guys the power that this thing has right now. Now we are at the airport spawn. Um, we definitely wanna check this door. So I'm gonna swing like way around, uh, but for the sake of the thumbnail, let's get a quick screenshot here real quick. Get a little inspect in, you know. You'll see it on the screenshot on the thumbnail there. All right, let's get it going. This thing is a bit slow, so you know, I'm gonna pull out my fists until I get a secondary to move around. But man, this thing is probably one of the best weapons in DMZ, honestly. Um, strong contender for that. Gotta get our money, get our funds up. I know there's usually some AI around here. Like the damage out from, output from this gun is so insane. It's it's absolutely amazing. Look at that! It just destroys them. It's beautiful. No, get around the corner. Oh, that got a little scary. Getting a little swarmed here, but we'll be all right. I do not want to start off our run dying to some AI. All the tier threes here, though. Come on now. All right. Ooh, a mini bock, you know? I don't feel like I actually get this too often. Right. Yeah, I'll definitely take this. This should, be, this should be good. All right, let's move along. So I think what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna circle way out here, getting a couple caches along the way. Seeing what stuff we can loot up, maybe get a three play, two play, you know, something like that. It'd be pretty sweet. I need to avoid all this combat because they're just burning through my plates. Hopefully, we can find a store with airstrikes because the, you know, last few attempts, if you guys have seen, I, I haven't even found airstrikes. I mean, I was doing the X fill with, you know, six kill streaks in one go, which we completed, which was great. But even then, I never found, um,. Uh, airstrikes. That's, I don't know. I don't know if just unlucky or rare. I'm not really sure. Maybe we'll find out this run. This row, though, it's, it, it's pretty incredible. Like, I can just sit here and just one tap. You know what I mean? You could probably put it on single fire, but I'd just rather control it myself and not have to switch, to be honest. But it's definitely an option. You could put this thing in single fire mode. And just single tap a lot of enemies. It's pretty good. Yeah, I had a feeling that was going to happen sooner or later. I'm sure this person hears shots. Figured that might happen. That's okay. As long as he doesn't have a sniper. If he has a sniper... Uh, it's possible this end, this run could end a little earlier than planned. Um, we'll see. Um, there's, uh, yeah, I was like, I know there's one more here. Okay, didn't have anything good, though. Let's go back to the water, because, again, you guys a sniper, you know, we don't really want to deal with that. You know, I'm really glad they don't have, like, any underwater sea creatures or anything like that in the game. One, it would be annoying, right, if they had, like, sharks or something. Two, I'm actually terrified of that kind of stuff, so if they did, I'd really hate swimming. Like, I don't know why, but even in a video game, I just don't want to deal with, like, sharks underwater or anything. In real life, I love swimming, but I, don't, I also don't go where, you know, there's, there's sharks. So, I prefer them to not add 
Something like that. Little little phobia there. Mmm, Vaznak. Vaznak. No, you know, honestly, I'm gonna stick with the mini -bock. I haven't used the mini -bock, like too much in um Warzone. I would normally go with the Vaznak, but I kinda want the extra mag. Kinda do. Okay, so this is gonna be a little bit of PvP here, most likely, I'm thinking. Um, the unfortunate part about that is I only have a one-play vest, so it's gonna be really stressful PvP. But I wanna check this store. This store could be the one with the kill streaks, so I mean we're gonna check it. That's that, you know? And to do that, we're gonna have to activate this UAV tower and clear out any other real players that are at airport. If they haven't already spotted me. I don't see any sniper glints, so. I'm probably okay. Could be using spotter scope, but eh, I think I think we're okay. I think we're all right. Question. Okay, towers down. Hopefully, they're not just gonna reactivate it right away. If they're camping UAV tower, then we might have a problem. All right, sweet. We got a little bit more money there. Let's reload this before we get into the mix of anything over there. One, we're seeing increased activity okay, in the I do Keep see... On. Did I just see something right there? Well, the UAV tower is not reactivated. I do see a door open right there. I wanted to go to that ladder, but now there's AI at that ladder, so now I'm going to go to the next ladder. Oh, please don't activate that UAV tower. I know exactly which one this is. I think we'll try for... Oh, that's the... Oh, it's locked. Okay. I think I heard a door over there. Attracting a little bit of attention. Oh, shots there. That could be a real player. Okay. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Let's go. Time to see what's going on. Okay, so whoever it is is out of range. Now they know that I'm here, so we have another situation. Okay. Let's move towards the store, because that's what we need to do no matter what. This area right here is clear of AI, which is actually good, because there's a ton of cash registers underneath me. So if... This has the kill streak. Store has also been touched. Something else to keep in mind. Precision airstrikes? Nope! What a surprise. I still want to loot these. You guys friendly? Hit that UAV tower. Figure out where these guys are.
All right, guys. Sorry. I'm not, I'm not so friendly. They had a bounty to kill me. I just, there's no way. There's no way. I just, you know, no, it's not happening. There's no way. I will, you, you pick a bounty on me and then you want to try to, no, I don't trust. I don't trust. Honestly, the way, the, the way he sounded, it sounded like they were trustworthy, but, uh, you know, guys, like I said in one of my last videos, I don't trust anybody as a solo. I just don't. It's uh, that's a tough one for me to try to trust somebody in solo. That's a tough one. Like, sorry guys, but yeah, that's just not me. And the benefit I gained from taking you guys out, I mean, I got money, I got two plate vest, I got a revive pistol, I got munis, and even a little bit more. I'm sorry. Just had to be that way. Do you see how much this row just immediately destroyed them? And the thing about the row is, as well, um, this... Sorry about that. Anyway, as I was saying, the thing about the row, is there one more guy up here? Oh, yes, there is. Hold on. I want to deal with him first. It's going to be annoying if I don't. Is that, um... It, it has like an initial kick, right? I think like about the, maybe the first five shots, it has like this initial kick, right? But after that, nothing, nothing. The thing is smooth, smooth. Ooh. Ew. No, change my mind. I'm not walking around with an LMG and a, you know, you know what I'm saying? I'm not gonna do that. Um, I'll keep the Muni. I don't really need the hard drive anymore. And I don't really need anything else he has. Um, let's see. I don't really need anything else he has. I'm gonna reload here. What's the next door I should check, you guys? I'm thinking... Fortress. I mean, that's the clo That's the next one that's closest. So, it's probably the play here. Let's leave it. Get some ammo there off of that. Um, and, yeah. Let's go head out. Hopefully we can find, you know, precisions, because... Apparently, they're just the hardest thing to find. You know, I shouldn't have crashed that helicopter. I did it because I wanted to, like, react immediately and not, like... I don't know. When you try to descend in the chopper, it takes a while. But in reality, that would have been such a useful um, vehicle for me. Like, such a useful to check all the stores really quickly. So, eh, maybe that part wasn't the best decision ever. But, eh, it is what it is. Learn from our mistakes. Yeah, man, move out the way, bro. You didn't hear me? This thing's loud. Come on, now. The good news is about this store is it looks like it's not, like, deep. It's right on the outside, so I'm not going to have to fight, like, boards of AI to check it out, you know? Come on, let's get ourselves a precision. Yeah, this gun's amazing, though. And I've done, mind you, a ton of different row builds. Like, a ton of them. Um, and this is definitely the best one, in my opinion, so far. Just kind of waiting for this AI to pass, but I really just don't want to deal with them. Not when I just want to check the store. And they could also be good targets for the precision, because with this, I have to kill ten enemies with the precision, so... It had. It's the one with precisions. <gasps> oh my god. This is the one. Okay. But, scary, it's been opened. So, there could be a team here. Now we gotta find money, though. Now we must find money. <gasps> that stack of cash. Alright, we have one precision. Oh no, not yet, not yet, not yet. Spoke too soon. I'm gonna pick up these. Ah, can we find a backpack? It'd be pretty nice to find a backpack. I really hope whoever's here is just gone. Honestly, I don't want to be disturbed trying to complete this right now, to be frank. I really don't. Um, will we need the stronghold key? Nah, I don't think we will. I'm gonna throw it on the ground. 
We're gonna need the space. Now I need the hard drive. <laughs> I had a feeling that might happen too. Okay, so he's even looted this building in particular. Oh, what in the... Well, 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 well. That is absolutely lovely, actually. Oh man, we got, yeah, we got money funds here. This is great, this is amazing. We can come back and get some extra plates too. I'm a little nervous. I'm a, I'm a little nervous. This is the first run of the day. Yeah, I'm a little nervous. Okay, now we gotta... We're gonna go back here. Pick up on the plates. Because you never know if we're gonna get into a fight. Along the way, you never know what to expect. Gotta be prepared, always. Um... Okay. Now, we gotta find just a clump of enemies. Which I think this place might be really good for that. Um, I'm gonna zip up there, because we might be able to get, you know, a good view on a cluster of enemies. And hopefully we can complete this one. Because I'd love to move on from this and start um, doing some Black Mouse missions and stuff for you guys. Here. All right, guys. Finally got some precisions on our hand. Let's go get some AI kills. Where did all those AI from before go and travel to? I wonder if they just split up everywhere. Hmm. That's not a big enough clump, I don't think. Actually, let's activate the UAV tower. What, what am I doing? One, let's just, you know, be safe, as always, right? Two, I'll be able to see the clumps of enemies. It's perfect. Okay, I had a feeling that clump would be, like, underneath me. Oh, jeez. Okay. Oh, no, buddy. Slow your roll. Of course, activate the UAV tower and I get swarmed. This to be expected. I should know this is coming. Okay. Wow. Really not like the kind of clumps I'm looking for. Oh, okay. Okay. Calm down, buddy. Slow your roll. Oh, okay. Hold on, hold on. Unless these guys are coming out down there. Eh. Eh, I don't- I just don't- I don't think this is where I'm gonna accomplish, like, a massive amount. Ooh, as I- as I'm dying to AI. Okay, okay. We're gonna get out of here, and we're gonna go back to airport. I think airport will be... I need a helicopter to just drop a bunch of AI in. Honestly. That's what I need. You know what I'm talking about? You ever seen the, just the clump of AI that just get clumped up together? That's kind of what I'm looking for. It's that clump of AI. So it's like four down there, which... I mean, isn't bad. I could be getting greedy with this, right? Like, and then I die, and I don't get, you know, much of the mission done. I got greedy. That's very possible as well. Uh, let's ignore him. Okay, I have plenty of room for plates. Okay. Alright, we're gonna go... Yeah, we're gonna go over to airport. I think I just, I'm comfortable with airport, I know airport, that I feel more confident, I'll get like a 
cluster of enemies and get the kills I'm looking for. <gasps> I did just see that guy fly off the top there. That worries me a little bit. I don't really want interruptions. Like I was saying earlier. After I get it done, I don't care what happens. Uh, it don't matter to me what happens after that. I'm up for anything. Where am I going to find just a cluster of enemies? Octar Village, you know? Octar Village is always just flooded with enemies. Let's go there. Oh! There's some spice going on over there. Uh-oh. You see that explosion? I wonder what that was. Huh. I'm really not sure what that exactly that could be. I do believe if I sneak in right here, that's like one of the... Like, one of the AI points I can get into, like, quite safely, if I remember right. Yeah, I should be able to slip in here. Even though this place is flooded with AI. I should be able to slip into here and hit this tower. Get See the clump of enemies. Move on from that. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I mean, look at that. Let's get them all aggroed on me, huh? Let's get everybody coming my way. Make sure there's no real players trying to mess with me. Same time, huh? I mean, there's a fat clump there, but I don't know. I think I go up here, maybe? To be able to get a better angle than all of them. Ah, oh, I really... Mm, mm -hmm -hmm. Look at that clump. Where's that clump? Where's that clump of enemies? Right there. I guess I can try to... I'll try to get them with one of them. Uh-oh. I wasn't working there for a second. That clump's like inside. This clump is like pursuing me. I want to go for the clump that's over here. The clump that's right here. Hope I don't kill myself with that. What? Use precision airstrikes to kill 10 enemies. Um. Okay, there we go. Okay, it's delayed. Man, three. Yeah, this, this is gonna... This mission's unlikely for me to complete it in one go. Okay, well... You know, it is what it is. We'll have to work... We'll have to work our way at it. Um. Are we gonna get the next best pump? That's the real question. Oh! Well, that's not nice. Ultra One, we're seeing increased activity in the air. Stay sharp. That area seemed to have had a decent amount. Two of them. And there's two there. Okay, okay. Man, now, you see that? Now a helicopter shows up. Exactly what I wanted to kill. You know? Alright, so we got it halfway done. Let's let's work on exfilling. Let's work on exfilling, because that's going to be a, a journey in its own, you know? Um, hopefully, you know, we can complete the rest of that mission on the next raid here. Yeah, let's work on getting out of here, because, as you know, as a solo, X filling can be uh, a little spicy sometimes. Actually, should we do a hostage X fill? Like a solo X fill? 
could, that could be worth, actually. Let's try it. Let's try it. It sounds fun. Honestly, it sounds fun. I've done hostage exfils. I just haven't done one solo yet, so let's give it a go. Man. Really couldn't find the clumps of enemies. If you guys know any strats, um, let me know in the comments below for that mission if there was any, like, any specific good places to go or ways to clump up enemies. Um, cause yeah, couldn't, couldn't really find one there as you saw. Just gonna have to do it. That's gonna have to be a two-piece mission, you know? Let's play it up real quick. Actually, I want to activate this UAV tower, too. Eh, nah, nah, nah. It's not- I don't really think it's even worth my time, to be honest. We're trying for a hostage exfil anyway. Let's see how difficult doing this solo is. Really interested in seeing this. Also, in the comments, do you guys know what that helicopter drops? Like, so I've looted his airdrop once. I know you can get a Building 21 access card, but is there, like, a mission at some point to to do that? To take him down? I wonder. Okay, so... Oh, it's gonna be over here. Honestly? That's probably gonna be easier than I expected, because... Um... When I was just there, it, there wasn't too many AI there. Even though there are times I've been to the farms over there and or the cemetery, and it's been uh, pretty packed. It didn't seem like there was this time. Well, would have been nice to activate that UAV tower when I was there, but whatever. We'll go and do it now. I think I saw an AI to my left. Yeah, I knew I'd get knocked there, but kind of just wanted to risk it anyway, to be honest. I kind of think I have to. Ooh, that was close. Yeah, that was close. And now where do I have to get to? Okay. Okay, and we're gonna run to the right. Hopefully that AI doesn't shoot at me. Alright, let's get the move on. Honestly, not bad. Not bad. I would say not too difficult in solo. It probably varies, you know, from, you know, mission to mission depending on what location and stuff. Because I know the first one I did was like a two-story building. Um, and obviously, like, how... You know, I, I, I had to go there and, like, there wasn't that many AI around it. You, there could be AI surrounding the area that have nothing to do with the mission that could make it, like, a lot harder. Sorry, buddy. Didn't mean to just, you know. But you gotta do what you gotta do. Go the backpack, get some extra points here. Come on. Let's go. Yeah, that was easy. I definitely advise doing the hostage exfil, you guys, if you're solo. As you can see here, that was a really clean way to get in and out without you know, really running into anybody. Anyways, 
as usual guys um if you like this make sure to like comment subscribe you know it helps the algorithm and next i'm going to show you guys the row build so for this row build we're going to go with the stip 40 grip here with this tuning we're going to go with this stock and this tuning then we're going to go with this optic as this one provides a bit more of a zoom than something like the amop v4 um, but also has that reduced recoil as it's not a high zoom optic with this tuning and then we're going to go with the talon 16 muzzle with this tuning and we go with the sa side grip with this tuning ultimately what this build provides is a really stable and controllable recoil while also having you know all the other good things that a row has about it anyways catch you guys next time peace